An unusual race was held at the Island Falls Summerfest Saturday. News Source 8's Cameron Lavasser has that story. The stakes were high in Island Falls Saturday as 400 plus competitors took to the Mattawam Keg River in a race to be the fastest duck. If people come with a list of numbers and they're serious about their ducks, like I gotta have this number. The ninth annual Island Falls Duck Race took place Saturday as a part of the town's yearly summer festival. The event started with less than 50 ducks in 2015, but now that number has grown to over 400. We just had a lady here this morning. She says they planned their whole week around the duck race this morning. So everybody looks more and more forward to the, the duck race. Pete, Pete Conley, he's the one that said I have these ducks and I'm looking for somebody to run a duck race. And so I thought of it for about half a day. <laughs> and I decided I would do it. And my husband has been helping me ever since. And Connolly, like everyone else, takes the race very serious. Uh, I have I I bought 12 ducks, but I have to be very neutral here. Uh, my ducks get tested for drugs afterwards. We drug test the ducks afterwards, and so uh, we think it should be a clean race. The ducks are dumped off the Route 2 bridge into the river and go through the rapids towards the yellow rope strung across as the finish line. First duck to cross wins. The event is a 50-50, with half the proceeds going to the winner and the other half is scholarship money for local students heading to college. Uh, Island Falls uh, is created because of this little island, and we thought, let's get more people to appreciate it and see what we have. Uh, it's a wonderful gift that everybody can enjoy. Island Falls resident Rebecca Drew, who recently retired after 23 years as a librarian, took home the prize this year. I had five ducks in the race, and I... You know, I mean, everybody hopes and, and kind of wishes, but you know that there's a lot more out there. And so, you know, you think, well, you know, but yeah, I, I didn't get to the point where I thought, well, gee, if I win, I'm going to do this. So, no, it's, it's, yeah, it's a blessing. Organizers say people should buy ducks earlier next year to secure their spot in the race, one that is sure to continue to grow in the future. It's just what we do, and small town fun, I guess you label it that, and then you work hard to make it that. Cameron Lavasser, News Source 8.